now have the 1.15 experimental patch of Daisy live on experimental. It seems like they're getting ready for the Christmas holidays. Want to get the update out and stable before the end of the year. Some of you may know who this is. The OGs will. This is Batty. She used to be the old community manager and she's finally been implemented into the game. As you can see, she's got a tattoo there. That's a nice little touch. I think it's really cool. And I'm sure she'll be happy to be able to play as herself next time she plays. Now, I do know a lot of people will be happy for this. The org it has returned. We have the AURA1, which reminds me more of the old org. You've got the old site. We also have the AURAX. The canted site is nice to see as well. There's also a suppressor. It's not quite finished yet, so at least we know we'll be able to attach a suppressor to the org. And if we go into the uh, files, there is also an org optic. Unfortunately, we can't spawn that in just yet, but that should be for the canted site one, I would have thought. Have you ever picked up a night vision scope and done this? Hurts your eyes? Well, the devs have finally done something about it. You can now take it off. You can switch it to day mode, I want to say it is. And when you put it back on your gun and down the site, you can now use it in daytime. I don't know how useful it's going to be how many people use it i don't think i would personally but it's there as an option if anybody does want to well they have to certainly tweak some fire rates that was a m4 with a 60 round stand egg mag Can now saw off the top bar of the FAMAS. As you can see with this version, it's got no bar, the old one does. I think this one's going to be eight miles better. It just seems easier to, I don't know, you got a bit more feel of view, I guess. I like it. Sorry, buddy. They have also made it available to strip barbed wire and make it just metal wire now, which is a nice touch, especially for the base builders out there. I know when you're looking for metal wire, you can never find it. So this one should make it a little bit easier. The baseball bat. So many people have asked for this, and finally we can do it. We can craft a barbed baseball bat. I know a lot of people will be running around with this. I like how it's got the blood stains on it and stuff like that. I'm guessing they took some inspiration from Mungard with this one. Dry bags, you can now patch them with a tire repair kit. I don't know why it's a tire repair kit, but hey, it's possible to do so. Finally, we can wear head torches with hats, any headgear. Uh, change it so it takes up the eye slot so you can wear hats with it. I know when I had the server, I modded this so I could do it, but it's a vanilla feature now. Now when you cut a bush down, you will get a long stick instead of short sticks.
You now get a sound effect switching between fire modes. When you get hit by a zombie now or anything, you get like a little mark on the screen from the direction you get hit. Grenades now cannot be repinned once the fuse is started, so meaning if you drop it on the floor and pick it back up, you cannot put the pin back inside it. That sound is a Christmas tree. They've now added a sound to it, and as you can see, we have Santa's sleigh, which is pretty cool. I'm guessing this is the Christmas update. We will see more things added, I would guess. Getting closer to December, they wouldn't want to throw it all in now and give it all away. We also have a zombie Santa. As you can see, there's tattoos on his arms and stuff like that. Pretty cool. I'm looking forward to this one. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you next time.